Hello everyone, welcome back to Landscaping. Today we will be mowing lawns. We'll be heading over to the shop this morning in our brand new 2020 Jeep Gladiator. A few days ago I did end up picking this truck up and I did trade in the GMC 1500. This is fully loaded here being the Rubicon trim level and we do have the BF Goodridge tires. Let's hop on in and head to the shop. Now not only will this truck be a grocery getter, I do want it to put it to work here with the company. I want to tow some trailers with uh, these skid steers and the zero turns on the back. Today is an exciting day here for us as we get to demo the brand new Bobcat mowers. We have the Bobcat 72 inch uh, rider and we also do have a 52 inch stand on mower. We're we'll also be using the 2020 Ram 3500 Cummins and the Big Tex utility trailer. If you do find today's video entertaining, please drop a like. It's much appreciated as it helps out with the YouTube algorithms. In the last few days here, I've really been enjoying this Jeep Gladiator here. It's one sweet truck. I can't wait uh, to be towing trailers with the doors off the roof off as well, which should be a lot of fun. The list of lawns for today is all residential. We'll be going about town here probably for uh, 13 to 15 lawns. Uh, really just depends on how much we get done. And I think why don't uh, today, why don't we park in front of this door here. We won't be using it and the uh, Gladiator will be out of the way. But this is such a sweet truck here. It's so nice uh, to add it here to the landscaping company. Really, really do like this a lot and I can't wait to see what it does. But let's get the doors open up here and get going. Now we do have to get everything loaded up here before we head on out, but why don't we take a look here at the brand new Bobcat Mowers. Uh, now Bobcat Mowers was just bought by Bobcat Company, uh, which makes the skid steer. So look at that guys, we have the brand new 52 inch stand on and the brand new 72 inch rider. And the best part is they do now match the Bobcat skid steers. We do have a few of them you guys can see, which is awesome. So that's the big difference is the color and there's a lot of just improvements over the older uh, generations as well. So before we get the Cummins all turned on here we do have to get this uh, door opened up here and let's get loaded up I'm really excited to be back here behind the wheel of it, this Ram 3500. This is one of my favorite trucks here with this series. It's just so great. It's a great work truck. Being a dually and having that Cummins is just the way to go here for us. And we do uh, put this to work. Every time we use it, we do tow some pretty big trailers all the time here. You have to get lined up. Don't have a backup camera. Pretty much uh, just a base model truck. Now I hope everyone's been having a pretty good day here so far. Let me know how it is down below. My day has so far been pretty good. And let's see, looks like we will have to get uh, the uh, wires attached here. We'll just have to double check really quickly when we're inside. But more than likely, uh, we'll have to get those attached. Now with the landscaping series, we have been very busy uh, this uh, season uh, so far. So many jobs from mowing 70 plus lawns a week uh, to the huge uh, landscaping jobs. And they just keep getting bigger and bigger, which is very exciting here for us. It's always nice uh, to make that extra money and uh, to make some great videos for all of you. Now I do try to be as realistic as possible here with my videos, which is awesome. It's a lot of fun uh, to make daily uploads and you guys are what are making it possible. Now I do want to fold up this chute here, but first time getting to use this, the controls are a little bit more touchy, a little bit more precise, but it is awesome to get these demos. That way we don't get to buy them, uh, but we get to kind of uh, use them and really uh, kind of uh, see how they do. And that's nice. We don't have to spend a lot of money because zero turns nowadays are thousands and thousands of dollars. I'm really excited about this one here though and maybe at the end of today we'll get some pictures outside on the grass with the skid sears next to these because that is pretty cool uh, uh, that Bobcat uh, purchased the mower Bobcat brand and now we have them so we're all loaded up we're all ready to go we do have a few weed eaters in the bed of the truck there we have it. The shop doors are all locked up there. I did run inside the office to quickly grab the list of lawns here for today. They are all kind of under one acre here, which is great, and I really can't wait to use them. Hopefully, uh, these mowers do well here, but it's just so cool to always get new mowers, new things in general for these videos. You guys seem to really be uh, liking that. So both the uh, subdivisions we are going to today are mainly where all of our lawns are at, which is awesome, and I can't wait uh, to kind of get going. 
Now these mowing and lawn care videos and the landscaping series has been so far performing really well here on YouTube, which is awesome. This is one of my favorite series to film. It's a lot of fun, and I can't wait for what's to come. We do have a big fall season, trying to finish up some huge uh, jobs that we will be taking on. So that should be fun, and we do have some other things uh, going on as well here, which is awesome. So we do have, I think it's one lawn in here we do have to mow. It's actually this house here. Let's go around the circle and then we'll kind of get parked up here. Now I am trying to mow different lawns every single video. Not the same lawn, uh, not even the same area of town here. But it's actually this blue one we have to mow. Pretty tight squeeze there, uh, but here we go. Now I do plan to do an upgrade video soon here with this series as well. We do want to get some new equipment and we will have to get ready for uh, fall and then winter. I'm already getting uh, the winter accounts ready, uh, ready to go here. But let's hop here on the Bobcat 72 inch. Uh, this thing is so sweet here. Every time I look at the color I'm like wow that is just awesome here. It's so cool that it does match here. Let's get the blade dropped here and let's get mowing. Now I really do like the realism here in my videos, it's a lot of fun to have it and to uh, play the game as realistic as possible here and I am working on some very big projects. I should be revealing one of them that I've been talking about for a very long time within the next week. More than likely this upcoming weekend I will be revealing that big surprise here which many of you guys will really like. I'm really excited for it and then I do have some other big big things here in the works. So far I'm really liking this uh, 72 inch here, it's just such a nice mower, I'm a big fan of the big 72 inch decks here, they're just so efficient for us and we could get a lot mowed. Now let me know down below in the comments guys, would you like me to kind of cut more of my videos, do more editing if you guys would like that, I could definitely do it but I also kind of like the style that I'm at with very few edits, I just kind of like them, uh, so let me know down below which uh, type of videos you guys would prefer. Now this past weekend we did have a lot of fun here with the homeowner series, you guys did enjoy those videos as well which is great and we do have a lot of content coming with that series and everything else is just going to keep getting better and better as the months continue. Now I have heard that the Bobcats do lay down some really really nice stripes here so we'll have to see what happens. So like I have touched upon the story is that Bobcat I actually bought the Mower Bobcat brand and uh, they are kind of rebranding it to kind of go along with all their other equipment which is awesome. Now these just uh, kind of got revealed here a few weeks ago and I thought uh, when I first watched that reveal live we just have to have those in Farm Sim. No problem here doing this here, which is awesome. Oh, we have a clothesline. We got to watch out that we kind of don't take down the clothesline here. We do have the roll bar up as well. We'll have to be as careful as we can. Now, if you guys have not already, I do recommend you go give me a follow over on Instagram. I am posting every single day over there uh, some pretty cool sneak peeks and updates about the channel. And you guys get to see things over there usually before you see it on YouTube. Now with this uh, kind of clothesline here, it is kind of old fashioned for people to be putting out the clothes, but hey, uh, you are definitely kind of being helpful here, not using as much electricity uh, in the dryer. Now I do kind of want to use some more uh, mowers here, some different types, maybe some just lawn tractors, I kind of see how they do here with the commercial setting and also things like that. So let me know if you guys would like me uh, to do some of those videos. But I am trying to do these weekly mowing videos here. They're a ton of fun, and they're just something I really do enjoy. So it looks like this property here doesn't really need much uh, leaf blowing or weed eating. So I think we'll probably just blow down the driveway and call it a day here. But I always do try to not shoot the grass all over. That's also something uh, that I do spend a little bit more time with uh, on the mower. But it saves us a lot of time and energy here. But there we go, guys. That's pretty much it here. Let's get the mower deck turned off and we're good to go. Now I always try to raise up the deck here so we don't scrape up our trailer but also damage it but I will have to say first time using the new Bobcat and wow that is sweet. Now I will have to say if I could have uh, demoed one of these in real life that would be even better here but let's get going and we'll get out the leaf blower here we'll just kind of blow off either side here which is good. There we go here and really quickly we'll get the weed eater just go around a tree or two like that. That looks to be good and we'll just come around the house right here and perfect so there we go guys we got this one done here we have just around 14 more we got a mow 
Now, I think it would be pretty cool here for a video to kind of show you guys all 14. Maybe do a quick time lapse video. I think that will be very interesting. Let me know if you guys would like me to do that. But you guys have also been requesting that we kind of don't uh, mow the houses that are right next door to each other for the videos. And I kind of like that as well that we kind of drive and not just do the same ones uh, that are right next door to each other. So we are actually here. We mow every single yard in this, but there are different schedules as well, different uh, kind of clients wanted different days here for us, but we were actually doing this one over here, the one we just quickly passed. Now I think for this one, why don't we try out the stand on, it's not as big and it's a pretty uh, small one. I do try to match the uh, deck uh, in the mower to the size of the yard. We'll get this backed off here, but wow, every time I look at this mower, I'm like, wow, it's just such a sweet mower and it looks so great. I hope everyone's been having a pretty good school year so far. Let me know how it is down below. It is a bit different, I will have to say, but so far, I've been just really busy here. A lot of schoolwork here, but I can't wait for the holiday uh, season. All the kind of mini vacations that I will have here. Let's drop down the chute now. I really want to get a, a chute blocker as well. I think that would really help out, and we could actually prevent any uh, kind of grass from shooting out when we needed to uh, kind of turn around near things and stuff like that. Now I do have some more mods here in the works for some of my uh, series as well. I do try to make some custom unique mods uh, for me, each of my series here, which is something that I actually find really enjoyable here. But I will have to say so far, it really doesn't mow as quickly as our 72-inch uh, there, probably because it's a smaller engine. Yeah, the property line is right behind the shed here, really uh, not as big here. You guys can actually see there's a farm over there, and we do have a farming series on the channel. I am trying to feature it as much as I can, but once again, I'm really uh, busy here with everything uh, going on and some big projects that I am currently working on. Now with the stand on mowers, these are actually becoming more and more popular here, which are pretty awesome. I will have to say I actually really do like these stand ons, especially on hills. I would much prefer one of these instead of riding on a mower just in case I got to jump off it. It's a lot easier than a, a ride on mower. And I think we could probably fit uh, four of these on the trailer while for stand-on, uh, for stand-ons we could fit four, but while uh, for just the regular zero turns like the 72-inch, uh, we could probably only fit uh, two of them. There's just that big of a size difference between them. Let me know down below in the comments, guys, if you have seen this new Bobcat uh, mower design. I did kind of watch the full live reveal, which was awesome, and I w definitely can't wait to use these. Maybe we will have to buy one or two of these demos as well. Sometimes we do buy them, other times we just kind of use them for the week. I will have to say this is one awesome mowing setup we have. I do try uh, to kind of uh, have the best mowing setup here in town, the best equipment uh, to be most efficient, but that comes duly with that trailer and also these mowers look sweet. We should be able to get this done here in no time. Not really going for any striping. Sometimes uh, the customers actually kind of request that we do a huge striping pattern, but other times like this one, they just kind of want the uh, yard mode and uh, want just fair pricing. Now let me know down below in the comments, guys, if you do mow lawns here. I know many of you do. Uh, many of you uh, at least mow your own lawn or uh, kind of others, which is awesome. It's great to get out there and great to kind of get working. The 72 inch Bobcat is a diesel while this one here is a gas. It could also be a little bit on why it's not as quick as uh, powerful here, but I will have to say the white with the uh, kind of Bobcat orange wheels look so, uh, so sweet. Really stands out, especially on the trailer going down the road.
making really good progress here, which is great here. And if you do have any cool video ideas, please let me know. I really, really am trying to do as many videos for you guys. Definitely want to do some more construction videos and some other ones here as well, which is uh, going to be a lot of fun here. But wow, we are just about done here. Looks like we're pretty good here on this. So let's just finish up this little front area and then we'll get loaded up. And I think that's probably where we'll call it a day here for us. It's been two lawns uh, so far, and we do have a lot more to go here. But definitely just making progress and uh, kind of making money. Oh, yeah, I can definitely see the dirt here on it. But so far, the blades have been cut in, and we are putting the blades to the grass. And I will have to say the cut quality is really good here on it. So let's get this uh, kind of loaded up. We'll get the other one loaded up, and we'll call it a day. And when you look at that, we do have the problem there with the ram but a little bit too big of a co collision sometimes I have noticed there but wow both of these on the trailer are going to look awesome And there we have it. Hope you guys enjoyed today's lawn care landscaping video. Getting to use the two brand new Bobcat demo mowers here to cut some grass. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for next one and subscribe for more.